I barely made it over there. Like if, if, if the call that she made to me would have been a few minutes later, I wouldn't have made it. I would have, we wouldn't be having this conversation right now. Scott Williamson has been through a lot in his life. I got in a car wreck when I was seven. I was on rescue seven. Had a hole in my head, like you see a scar up there. So when I was 14, I got paralyzed racing motocross. 21, I wouldn't let him go anywhere. When I was 21, she made me stay home. But nothing compared to what he experienced Easter Sunday. I was in my closet and she told me to get to her house ASAP. And I hightailed it over there, burning rubber. And, and it was literally within that time for me going from here to her house and getting in the bathroom that it hit. It was the scariest sound I've ever heard in my life. People say it sounds like a freight train. It was the sound like the devil. It was the worst growl I've ever heard in my life. Williamson lost everything when the EF4 tornado destroyed his home, including all material belongings and medical equipment. We found those in the rubble and his um, other some other medical stuff he had to have. I had so much that I could that was something that was like a one time thing that I don't know if I'd ever get back. You know what I mean? Williamson says he is trying to stay positive despite the awful course of events and is grateful for friends and family doing what they can to help. I got so many friends that I've met through the last two, three, few years through acting and, and meeting, going to the conventions and everything, that they have all pulled together and is trying to get me back or get us back everything that we had and everything that we lost. I cannot be thankful enough for all of them. They're, I, I say friends, but they're family.